Mark Edmondi for ESPN with Patricio Pitbull after the Bellator 263 press conference. Uh, Pitbull, things kind of uh, went went uh, like a little crazy there at the end of the press conference. What what happened? Like what what made you upset? What what kind of led to that altercation with AJ? If you want to make a, a fight against me, no problem. We are professional. We're gonna do that. But you can t you can't talk about my family. I have two childs and he was talking about beat me in front of my sons. That's terrible. I, I don't want, I don't want to represent someone like that, you know, because that's me, not my, not my son. Beat me. He's he's thinking about me in front of my son because of why? Man, it's the last one who talked about me and my family. I make him pay in one minute. He want that? Okay, I will do. I will do it for him. Michael, Michael Chandler. Don't talk about me and my family. I I will make you pay for that. You you and AJ have been uh, you know fairly respectful of each other. I know that it's gotten heated at times, but it was never it was never like that downstairs uh, just a few minutes ago at the press conference. Was that really what what set you off? As soon as he mentioned you know your wife and your and your See, children. See, he's yeah. he Bellato in the backstage. He's talking little about something. He and his father, like, como é que fala? A bota no porra, olha. Tic tac, como é que fala? Tic 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 tac. Like a uh, like clockwork. Yes, always. When they see me, he say something like this. I don't care. I I know it's part of the game, but man, stay off place, but don't don't put my family on this. So it's been kind of like building, building, building slowly because it's been kind of frustrating you, it seems. No, he, he, oh, he's a good fighter. I know he's dangerous. He deserves to be in this place fighting for the title. But let's do it as a professional. Don't put my child on, on this. That's it. I don't care if his father is his master. It's beautiful to see that. But show some respect. His father was saying, I am on drugs. He knows nothing about my life. He can't like for me like this. When he when he grabbed the belt downstairs, did that did that you know kind of escalate the situation that made things worse? He he when he grabbed the belt, he showed his disrespect again. Yeah. I I wouldn't I was nervous because he was Talk about my, my family, my son. In that time, he took my belt again. You were you weren't nervous. You were pissed off. I was busy. pissed it off. Yeah, I was pissed <laughs> off. I was angry. Doesn't matter. The, nervous is different. This this fight is um you know so big for for Bellator. You know it's the first one uh you know outside of the bubble. You know with COVID restrict, restrictions lessened. Uh, you know, people are saying this could be the biggest fight in Bellator history. How do you feel about this fight? Do you feel like this could be, you know, one of the biggest fights in, in the history of the promotion? I, I'm not thinking about that anymore. Oh, man. Yeah. Now it's serious. It's, per, it's personal. He doesn't man. know what's going to happen with him. It's become, it's become personal. No yeah. longer. Yeah. yeah. Him. Him. <laughs> and what is I mean what is a I mean he obviously he, people are talking about he is the bigger guy he's younger the whole the whole spiel what does a fight with uh you know Patricio Pibble versus AJ McKee look like how does that fight they, go they, they doesn't know nothing about martial arts if you are a real artist martial a real martial artist you know, you are longer than me is nothing. Your length. Your so you don't age. think it matters? It doesn't matter. It doesn't. All my life, irrelevant. I fought against guy that was bigger than me, always. Stronger, longer. Longer, yeah. And I mean, the stakes in this fight are, are obviously so high—a million dollars, the tournament championship, the belt. I mean. 
full crowd at, at the forum. Uh, and it seems like now that none of that stuff even matters to you anymore. Like the belt and the, you know, the prestige and all that doesn't even matter. Now it's more I, about I never, I never thought about the million. I always think about my legacy and I present, I presenting my country and bring some uh, good days for my family. That's it. Mm -hmm. You know, the, 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 the money is the consequence. And I know LA and the forum is a, a huge place to show to the fans a, a good performance, but they, they are here to see some violence. Let's do some violence. That's it. Do you think this is a chance to, you know, further remind people that that maybe maybe you're the best featherweight in the world. You know, maybe that you're maybe you're better than the guys in the UFC, the Volkanovskis and the Holloways. Another chance for you to show just how good you are. Yeah, I know I am the best. And now we have a Jim McKee as a contender, and he's undefeated, top with a lot of confidence. And I'm not gonna break his soul. It showed you everyone who is the best. And then what happened with uh, the Snoop Dogg? I guess he, he posted a uh, a video with Snoop Dogg talking about AJ. He's supporting AJ. And I saw your response, which a lot of people seem to enjoy on social media. What What's going on there? Yeah, that was funny. He was, uh, what we done? Inviting? Inviting. Inviting people to see the, the, the fight. But he told that the Jim McKee is going to knock me out. And I answer him like this, like that. So do you think uh, maybe you'll you'll call out Snoop Dogg after uh, after the fight on on Saturday? <laughs> I have some something better than that. Let's wait. What do you got? <laughs> give me a, give me a hint. I can't. You you will see. You you like that. Cool. Awesome. Pitbull. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Thank you. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.